Hi everyone, today we're going to be looking at how you can improve your XGBoost classifier using CleanLab. We will be using data-centric AI techniques which aim to improve the data set itself rather than altering the model's architecture or, or hyperparameters. Because of this, it's possible to achieve further improvements in accuracy by fine-tuning the model itself with the newly enhanced data. We will first establish a baseline XGBoost model accuracy trained on the original data. Then, we will use CleanLab to remove hundreds of mislabeled data points. After that, we will remove these automatically flagged label issues from the dataset and retrain the exact same XGBoost model. This simple step reduces the error in model predictions by 36%. The raw accuracy difference between the values between the two models is 8%. Finally, we will introduce a no-code solution called CleanLab Studio to efficiently find the label errors in the dataset which then reduces the error in model predictions by 70% from the baseline identical XGBoost model. First, let's take a look at our data inside of CleanLab Studio. You can see here we're working with a student grades dataset, which has student IDs, three exam scores, a notes column, and a grade assigned by the teacher. Now that we've seen our data, let's jump back into the notebook. We first read in the CSV file and do a few necessary transformations for both CleanLab and XGBoost model. Then we split our data into training and evaluation sets. We will modify the training set as we remove common issues like label errors, while the evaluation set will not change to offer a fair comparison across accuracies. After training our XGBoost model on our original data, we get an original accuracy of 79.2%. It appears that the presence of roughly 20% label noise is significantly disrupting the model's ability to accurately predict the labels on such a trivial task. To begin finding label issues, all we need to do is compute a set of predicted probabilities from a given model on your dataset. Run crossfile predict from scikit-learn with our XGBoost classifier with the method set to predict proba. Then in just one line of code, we pass the predicted probabilities and our training labels into the find label issues function from CleanLab to find all of the issue indices that CleanLab believes to be mislabeled. Here we see five examples that CleanLab believes to be mislabeled. We can see in the first example, the student received exam scores of 91, 89, and 81, yet they were given a letter grade of an F. This is obviously incorrect, and the correct grade should probably be a B, which is seen here. Now that we know which data points are mislabeled, Let's remove these from our training set and retrain the exact same XGBoost classifier. After this, we see that the new model, trained on the less erroneous data, has an accuracy of 86.9%, which is a 36.7% reduction in error. Note that throughout this entire process, we never changed any code related to the model architecture itself. All we did was improve the data. Instead of just dropping the potential label issues, the smarter yet more complex way to increase our data quality would be to correct the label issues by hand. This simultaneously removes a noisy data point and adds an accurate one. But making such corrections manually is cumbersome. Luckily, CleanLab Studio provides a user-friendly interface to make these changes without writing a single line of code. After just a few clicks, Studio computes everything we just did for you, so you can spend more time fixing the issues instead of just finding them. The CleanLab Studio interface provides you with all the tools necessary to correct your data. Let's take a look at all of the students who were incorrectly given an F when they should have been given an A. To change the letter grade to the CleanLab suggested one, just click Use Our Suggestion here. You can always go through each of the examples individually if you want perfect corrections, but for now, let's just auto-fix all of the issues, which changes the given label to the CleanLab suggested label. All that's left is to export your dataset with just a few clicks. Let's see how our model performs on this newly improved data. Here we read the CSV in, do the same pre-processing steps as before, retrain the exact same XGBoost classifier, and predict on the training set. Using this newly improved training set, our XGBoost model gets 93.6% on the testing set. 
This is a 70% reduction in error over the baseline identical XGBoost model. Let's do a quick recap of what we've done. First, we found label issues using CleanLab and dropped them entirely from the training set. This produced a 36% reduction in error. Then, we used CleanLab Studio to not only find the errors and remove them, but actually fix them. This resulted in a 70% reduction in error. Again, it's important to note that we never changed any of the model architecture or hyperparameters across this entire video. If you enjoyed this video, please check out the additional resources in the description below to learn more about how you can use data-centric AI to improve your data.